the, the album Them and Conspiracy are one big horror story. They're connected totally. And uh, we're trying to present all the entire story on stage, you know, but we're not playing the, the, the entire album Them. Uh, we're playing all the main songs from them so that we get all the main characters, main events in there. And that's what we're starting off with. And then we do uh, older stuff, you know, Miserable Fate stuff, we do uh, older King Diamond stuff. And then finally we come to, to side one of the new album and we do the entire side one. The overall story is that, uh, you know, uh, during them, my grandmother had these weird stations. She came out from an asylum, came back to her family to uh, spend the last days, you know, with the family. She picked up on these weird tea parties again in the, in the instant she was back in the old house Amon. And, uh, you know, it got out of control. She got me into the stuff. And uh, there's no way you can get out of it once you, you experience it, because that's like uh, the best thing you could ever experience, is being with them, feeling their warmth, you know, um, drinking this tea with a little bit of blood in it. And uh, that's what happened during the first one, you know. Then I finally you know she killed my sister, or my grandma made them kill my sister and uh, finally when she did that and the teapot broke I freaked out and I realized what was going on they also want to get rid of me because my mother is still scared of me she's convinced from what Dr. Landau told her that uh, I was the one who tried to kill her because of her open wounds the, the cuts in her arm you know, that were used for the teeth so uh, she wants to get rid of me because she's scared of me as well and maybe there's a little revenge in there as well you know they convinced the, the local priest to take part in this stuff so that they have an alibi. If one of them should start telling later on, the other one would have an alibi with the priest. So they're like, you know, securing themselves there by bringing him into it. And it's easy to bring him in because they just start talking about me being possessed by some kind of demon or maybe even Satan himself, you know. But then you've seen all the characters on stage, you've seen what's happening, you know, you see, uh, you see the cremation thing, the burned alive thing, you know, where the priest and the doctor and my mother at the end puts me into this coffin and burns me alive on stage. It's going to be pretty heavy. There's going to be a lot of surprises there in the show this time.